Scattered along the Earth's coastline at various locations are the remains of World War II era lookout posts. The men who manned them would watch the skies for passing aircraft, both Allied and German. They also monitored the sea for passing convoys and battleships. This lookout post is located close to Ballyglass on the northern end of the Irish Peninsula. Keith met up with JT Gohan, a member of the local RNLI, and no better man to give us a little history on these lookout posts. So JT, when and why were these lookout posts built? Back in the 1940s, just before the, uh, when World War II started, they needed to actually keep an eye on what was happening in the, in the bays, and particularly this one here, uh, Conan Inver Moor or Broadhaven Bay. Uh, any vessel could come in here and quite easily land uh, troops or things like that. So they built those uh, watchtowers in, in these locations, which were strategic locations, and as you can see, from Ellis Head to Kid Island, they had full command view of the, the entire bay. Yeah. And who would have manned these lookout posts? The LDF, the local defence force at the time, and afterwards known as uh, the FCA Force Custom Tartuary. So, and I still understand uh, at the moment that there is one member who actually manned this ferry station, still alive in the boat. So he, he would be someone to talk to about the actual happenings in, in, in one of those at the time, you know. And why would these lookout posts have been important to neutral Ireland in the war? Ireland had to give a commitment that she would keep a watch out on a report to and on all the coast uh, to watch the landings of any combatants in World War II. It didn't matter who they were, whether they were Germans, English, Americans or whatever, and they would report that to the, 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 the British as well, like you know, uh, such things did take place. And if people did come ashore, they would be arrested by our local forces. Would there be many more of these lookout posts dotted around Eris? Oh, quite a few actually, and they're known as, uh, in the Gwentlach Theatre, as Chaha Watch. So there'd be Porta Clay and there'd be Oh, many, many more. I'm sure that in Ellis alone there must be six or seven of them, you know, because of the indentations of the coast and the number of places in which people could come ashore. You know. So there's quite a few in Ellis. The Broadhaven Bay lookout post is located at the northeastern end of the Irish Peninsula. Because it was built quite late in the war, it never received its official number. The Black Sob Bay 1866 Company, bringing our maritime history and culture to life. This is our bay. These are our stories.